everyone, Christian here, and this is a nighttime vlog uh, because the uh, the purpose of this vlog is to show what happens at night. So um, I have potted up about 100 Copernicia ekmanii here, and they are from germinated seed that is coming from these pots right here. And so we have Pseudophoenix vinifera, which is not yet germinated, and there might be a few in there, but if you notice that when you, you can see how many seed I put that are still in this pot, but there was an extra hundred or so that were uh, in here. So I really mounted this pot up with seed. And you can see that where it's pushing up. And at nighttime, I've noticed, and I don't even know if this is actually true scientifically, but I have seen, maybe just because I come out in the morning and they've germinated, but I've noticed that if I come out at nighttime, I seem to find palms having germinated as opposed to in the middle of the day. I don't know if that's a uh, cultural thing, but that seems to be the way uh, that I've found them. So I tend to come out at nighttime and see what's going on, usually later on, and it's only 7 o'clock right now, Eastern time here in Florida. But, um, you know, if you come out at midnight, if you wake up in the middle of the night and you're curious, you know, it seems that these things tend to happen not in the middle of the day, but in the middle of the night. So if you get bored... And you want to go over to your hothouse or to your um, wherever you may germinate seed, a, a baggie of peat or orchid moss with seeds in them. Um, check them out, and a lot of times you'll find that uh, that something will have happened. So, um, yeah, these are the, these are the pots that I have mentioned. Now, this is a, these are a little dry for a reason, but um, these are the uh, Stewie TP thirty seven pots. They have a big hole in the middle. I like using the uh, MT. No, these the the MT37s are what the are are the the pots that have the slotted ones, but I'm using these just because I got a good deal on them, and uh, so they will work as long as you just don't let the soil fall through, fall through, not follow. But uh, yeah, so I have these all out here. These are just a few of the pots I have. I keep them out front because it's full sun, but um, you know, they're the sun will bake these seeds, which the, is what they what Copernicus need. So. We have Copernicia ekmanii, Pseudophoenix vinifera, Cocothrinax borhidiana, Cocothrinax cranida, um, Hemithrinax ekmaniana. So we're talking basically almost all Cuban seed beside the ekmanii and the uh, vinifera, so, which is from Hispaniola, so you know, not, not, not that far away. But um, yeah, you know, this is where I get the best germination, even this time of year. It's about 75 out right now, so... Um, you got to love that color on that garage door. Don't you love that? <laughs> so, um, you know, this is a, a compot of Hemithrinax in there. And this is a one gallon right here. And that's about three years from a germinated seed. So, unfortunately, they don't grow that fast. But, you know, part of the fun is getting to grow them from a seedling. This is one of the smallest seeds you'll ever see, uh, Hemithrinax. Let's see if we can get a close up here. You see how tiny they are. They're smaller than palmetto seed and um, as, as opposed to you can see here the Ekmanii seed. Um, so anyway, uh, by the way, all this seed is actually available on if you want to go to uh, Faulkner's Palms Facebook page. Uh, if you want some seed, ger you want some germinated seed already or you want some seed that's ready to germinate, um, most of this is still available. So I just wanted to kind of give you guys an you know, what I do and, you know, what palms can do at night, what I tend to do at night with palms, uh, check up on them. And I don't do this every night, but if I'm bored and I'm walking outside, I'm a little curious. Um, and I know seeds are going to germinate soon. So I always say this is when the magic happens. And most of the time it is because in the morning I find new things. So my best guess is at nighttime, this is uh, when they seem to like to, to pop open uh, that first cotyledon. So Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this little vlog about uh, what happens at night with palm seeds. If you did, uh, give it a thumbs up. If you are new to the channel, go ahead and subscribe, and you'll see many more palm-related vlogs. And if you have any questions about seed germination, this style where you're, this is full sun, so if you have any questions about that, obviously it's nighttime, but the sun is, <laughs> these don't get any shade. Um, so, you know, if you have any questions, leave them down below, and I will see you guys next time.